Hey guys, it's Harry. Uh, yeah, you know my hair is a little bit, a little bit out of it, so I'm just gonna turn around quickly. You guys see there behind me? I'm going into uh, Durbanville Brackenfell. Is it Durbanville or Brackenfell? Man? Durbanville Macro, and in Macro for nothing video, we are small more. I brought my lovely mother with me, <laughs> so we are on our way inside uh, Dur Durbanville, Durbanville Macro to come and try or try to find Mr. Beast's Feastable. So Mr. Beast, if you're watching this video, we're going to try and find your lovely organic chocolates. I'm going to see which flavor I'm going to like the most and then I will let you know what it tastes like. I'm going to try and do a full review. So Mr. Beast or Jimmy, this one is especially for you. Harry, on the way! Hey, Mr. Beast, it's Harry here. Uh, as you can see behind me in the background, I just came out of Macro here in my home suburb of Brackenfell, Cape Town, South Africa. And I got my hands on two of your Mr. Beast Feastables and I am literally going to try one of them as soon as I get home. And I will give you my honest review because I do believe they are very, very delicious. They sound very delicious and I am going to go the organic route from now on. So, here's to you, Mr. Beast. Hey guys, it's time for my review of the Mr. Beast Feastables chocolates. And as you guys probably saw in my intro and my photos that I put in the beginning of the video, as you guys have probably seen in the beginning part of the video, I went to Macro Brackenfell and I bought two of the four Mr. Beast Feastable flavors that are available in South Africa. I bought the one with crisps or uh, crispy puffs or something in them. And then I bought this one, which is the one we're going to do in the video right now. The Mr. Beast Feastables These Nuts Bar. <laughs> These Nuts Bar. And what's nice about it is, it's only si it's only seven ingredients, guys. Seven ingredients. And if you go back a little bit before the seven ingredients, these these nuts bar. All right. Now that we're on the right track, let's go ahead and open them because it says grass-fed milk. So I'm assuming I'm assuming it's organic. It's organic cows that roam around and so and so on. So let's have a look. Oh man, I opened this the wrong way now, but it's fine. Just open this on the bottom here. Okay. Oh, broke off a skew piece now. Oh, that's okay. So this is more or less. Okay, this is just the skew little piece that I broke off to me now, but this is more or less the size. As you can see, it's thin and compact, and I'm sure it's going to be delicious. Mmm. 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 Guys, I had to, I had to digest that for a moment because it was simply, mwah! Fantastic guys, I never had, I never had such good chocolate in my life before. It's like, oh, it's out of this world. Mr. Beast, if you're watching this video, you sir, definitely have hit the right market with these feastable chocolates of yours. It's really out of this world. I'm taking one more bite. Mm, guys, I'm so glad I took that second part because, oh, it was 
simply magnifique guys it was really really tasty and now you're probably wondering harry but you're in south africa so what um, what what does it go for and where can we find it well you can find it in one of two places here in south africa especially in cape town so i'm going to put it at the bottom of the screen so you can go find it at any game or macro retailer closest to you and the cost is only 50 bucks uh, 50 bucks the cost is only 50 bucks guys that's what it's going to cost you to get your hands on a mr beast feastables from either game or macro and that's all i gotta say mr beast so as for me the rest of my mr beast feastables these nuts harry on the way